Okay, check out my setup. So this is my two laptops. And the magic here is that by using one mouse, I'm using Windows 10, and I'm using Linux Ubuntu, and I can use them with the same mouse and with the same keyboard. If I type here, hello, it comes on the other screen. Very convenient. Okay, super exciting demo. So in this tutorial, in six minutes, I'll tell you how to do it. Let's go get barrier for Windows. Softpedia. Download now. External mirror. Download complete. Run the installer. Accept. Yep. Next. Install. Finishing installation. Launch barrier. So, this is your main computer. So, you're going to use this as a server. And take note of this IP address because that is the address you need with the client so once it opens up you usually don't have to make any uh, configurations or settings just use as it is and it says here barrier is running so if you have a client already running then it should be already working so let's uh, go to the uh, secondary computer which is running Linux and see how it works over there. So now I open the Ubuntu software application and type in barrier and it's very slow. After blowing off some steam it finally loads up and then I just click either of the links doesn't matter I guess and then install and after authentication the installation is completed after some waiting of course because this is an old laptop and you need patience and now you are ready to open barrier by typing it in in the search field so now you got barrier installed and open on your Linux so you're gonna copy the IP address from the server which in my case is 192.168.43.121 Don't use autoconfig, it doesn't seem to work. Sometimes it does, good luck if it does. And be sure to save 20 minutes of frustration by disabling SSL from the settings. Please do this or there will be much frustration. Okay. Now just tap start on your Linux. Tap start on your Windows. And it should say barrier is starting and barrier is running. If everything matches up on the planetary level, now your mouse is controlling everything. So you can go to whatever program you want on the Linux just by using the same mouse it's just very convenient and for example let's open the library office uh, that is obviously very slow because the laptop is like more than 10 years old easily I guess so now I'm using my keyboard Barrier is totally rad. <laughs> and everything works perfectly. It's so beautiful. The the thing is that if, if you have a computer that is even remotely powerful it's it's good for streaming purposes you can use the um, external webcams or 
the webcam from your laptop you can display any information you can use it as your teleprompter while you're actually recording something else or showing something else on your main screen and it's just overall a very handy program because um, it's seamless there's no delay uh, on the on the mouse or on the keyboards and this is it just uh, just make sure that you have the correct IP address disable the SSL and one way to troubleshoot it is to change uh, the client to server and the server to client and see if you can connect that way usually it solves the problem the so the last thing is to open up the settings and choose the location where you want to put the secondary screen relative to your main screen. For me it works that it's above my main laptop because that's where it's physically located so it's logical that when I move my mouse up the cursor goes to the screen above. So that's everything and I wish you get it working without a lot of frustration sometimes cross-platform things uh, cross laptop things can be tricky this is an option that works if you have patience sometimes it's uh, a mystery why it doesn't but with these instructions I hope you can nail it so thank you